What's going on YouTube? Just not right here. So in today's video we're talking about a brand new jailbreak coming for iOS 11 all the way up to iOS 13.5 and that is of course my jailbreak, Blizzard Jailbreak. So basically Blizzard Jailbreak is a jailbreak that I created mostly for the open source project that I keep, basically Open Jailbreak, which is available here on GitHub. This is a project containing everything you need for jailbreak development if you want to learn how to make a jailbreak or if you want to learn how to, I don't know, code for jailbreaks like tweak development and stuff like that. I keep a lot of things in here including tools and code and stuff like that. And of course as part of that project I only found it right to create a jailbreak that would be in the spirit of the open jailbreak. So a completely open source jailbreak which is now available in here. Now the jailbreak is not complete yet. I'm actively working on it but it's completely open source and many of the components are actually already done so they are available. If you open the repo there are a lot of things that you can find and of course the main components are in the blizzard jailbreak in here in the blizzard jailbreak.m so this is basically the bulk of the uh, jailbreak the main functions if you want to but this is going to be a pretty big jailbreak now in terms of support it will be basically like the uncovered jailbreak it will support iOS 11 all the way up to 13.5 right now the public version supports only iOS 11 and it's currently in development but since this is an open source jailbreak I wanted to make it public so that you can see exactly the progress and everything that is actually added in real Real time so it's actually available in here now in terms of the UI this is going to be something like this and as you can see it's a quick simple UI you don't need to have a very complicated UI you just need a couple of buttons to be brutally honest with you and that's mostly it and the jailbreak itself when you're jailbreaking looks something like this so basically you open the application and it shows like that you press the jailbreak button and something like this pops up it looks basically like Cydia when it tries to install something speaking of Cydia though this doesn't come with Cydia you're going to ask me why well I do believe that Cydia is actually good but it's very old at this point but I wanted something that is open source and new and stable so Zebra may Made a lot of sense so it comes with zebra which is actually quite modern and stable but if you want to install anything else you will be able to now in terms of the bootstrap this will come with the alucabratus which is basically the bootstrap that comes with the uncover which is actually very good very stable created by Sam Bigner and in terms of tweak support I'm going to use the substitute from the uncover team now I can use those as long as I comply with the licensing so it does work pretty well with the uh, open jailbreak concept because anybody can use those if you do comply with the license and of course if you do credit what it's due you would definitely be able to use that in your jailbreak so anybody who wants to create a jailbreak can use the substitute from the uncover and of course the elocubratus which is created by Sam Wigner. So yeah this is going to be it about my jailbreak this is the official twitter for this jailbreak is getblizzardjb which is going to be in the description down below but of course this is an ongoing project and as I said I will support iOS 12 and iOS 13 as well all the way up to 13.5 even on A12 and A13 devices. So basically anything from the iOS 11.0 all the way up in here to the 13.5. If you want to use it you will definitely be free too but this is completely open source and it's actually designed more for people who want to actually look at the code and understand what's going on. It's going to contain a lot of documentation for people who want to learn and of course if you want to check out exactly how it works you would definitely be able to. And if you combine that with the open jailbreak project that I have in here it would definitely allow you to learn how to create your own jailbreak pretty easily because you have a live example that actually works and can run tweaks and then of course you have all the tools and documentation that you need. So yeah that's basically it. The open source project is now available on GitHub and I will update it of course daily while I work on it. Check it out if you're interested in it and of course till next time I'm Geosnow and peace out.